Let's ask the good Lord to bless the task before us. Chaplain. O oh, great and mighty Lord, over heaven and earth, we humbly ask that you train our hands for war and steady our hearts for battle. Oh, how many are our foes, and how violent their hatred is against us. May those who want to consume us stumble and fall. They will not shout and triumph over us. Your steadfast love will cut them off. Oh Lord, we know that you've given your son to die for our freedom. Give us the strength to protect that gift which you've given to us. And may no harm come to any of our warriors who fight to uphold the glory of your name. Let his freedom reign. Let his freedom reign. Let his freedom reign. Amen. I don't remember giving you permission to speak. You didn't, sir, but I feel like this still is wrong. Son, tread lightly. We are in the middle of an awe. Chaplain said it himself, sir. The Son of God died for freedom. I think free men would pray for their enemies and forgive those who persecute them, like the Bible says. That does not apply to them. They do not believe in what we believe. It looks like I am the only one here standing up for what's right. Boss, we need to deal with this. We ain't gonna have that much more time up here, and he has made his decision. 